To capture an actor's performance, a special face camera was fabricated. By locking the camera's orientation to the actors, the video will always have the face in view, eliminating issues with marker occlusion. To ensure the entire face is in the camera's field of view, a target made of index cards stands in for an average human face. Focus distance is measured and will later be used to calculate the length of the camera's boom. The main structure is made from a pair of real D movie glasses. The polarized lenses have been removed. The lower frames are also removed for less obstruction and a lighter rig. The camera's boom is made from a stiff bailing wire and is secured to the glasses with heat shrink tubing. The tubing conforms to the frame's contours, ensuring a secure bond. A binder clip holds the wire in place during the heating process. A small notch is cut in the frames for the wire to rest in. One more section of tubing secures the end of the wire and prevents cuts to the user. A stripped down camera is wired to the end of the boom. Heat shrink insulates the circuit board from the wire boom. Here's the completed rig. The excess USB cable is used to secure the rig to the user's head. By pulling on the loose end of the cable, it tightens it. To use the face cam, simply put on the rig and tighten the cable till comfortable and snug. Now connect the camera to the computer. A USB extension cable is recommended if the camera's cable is too short for the expected performance scenario. With a live view of the face open, adjust the camera so the face is centered. After the user has captured a performance, the video is converted into a series of still images. The free software Virtual Dub is used in this case. Rotocap is launched within Maya where the colors are selected with the eyedropper tool and given unique names. Rotocap then tracks each area of color and applies the detected motion to a sphere. By simply linking the transformation attributes of a sphere to a control ring, the user can now drive their character no matter if it's slider or joint-based.